The hope is more vaccinations will help alleviate the strain on our hospitals. The challenge is vaccine hesitancy. COVID-19 vaccines being used right now have emergency approval from the FDA. The night team's John Paul Barajas explains what it means to seek full FDA approval. 50% of Americans are fully vaccinated with shots approved under the FDA's emergency use authorization, meaning the FDA makes a product available to the public based on the best available evidence instead of waiting for full approval. They're recognizing that we're in dire need of some response. Like they brought in the best minds, looked at it, and the best available evidence said, and as we've seen with the vaccine, the negative effects are somewhat minimal compared to the millions of people who've been vaccinated and now have some kind of protection against the virus. For some, emergency use isn't enough. They say they'll wait, but health officials across the board are urging everyone to get their shots as soon as possible. Dr. Corey Hallam with Texas Biomed explains, in a non-pandemic situation with the science just starting out, the process could take 15 years. But with decades of science and research already on mRNA technology that's being used in COVID vaccines, he says companies mainly ramped up clinical trials and started working on multiple phases at the same time. You're not skipping anything. You're essentially doing that in parallel. And as the data became available, FDA able to look at that. Dr. Hallam adds what's been approved under emergency use essentially will be the same vaccine under full FDA approval. If something were to change in the vaccine, the company would have to start once again with clinical trials. Right now, vaccine companies are still collecting more data as well as going through the due process of the FDA's approval phases. But just last week, President Biden did say he hoped to have a fully approved vaccine by early fall. John Paul Barajas, KSAT 12 News.